The streets of Algona were quiet Thursday, the day after Officer Cram died on duty. Residents paid their respects to Officer Cram by placing flowers and notes on a department car right outside the Algona police station. He wasn't a bad guy. He didn't deserve this, and neither did his family. On Wednesday night, the news of the shooting in Algona sent around through a community text message. This town's pretty tight-knit, so when something happens, you know about it fairly quickly. And something like this doesn't happen every day, especially in a city with little more than 5,000 people. I've lived here 30-some years and never heard anything about an officer getting shot, even getting shot at around here. When anyone dies in any community, some begin to realize that this can happen at any time. Oh yes, anytime. Makes you wonder if how what people really are like around here. I think when you're just in a small town, it makes you worry. But the tight-knit people of Algona know how to come together. I think everybody's going to have to come together, no matter what your race is, you know, your background, they're going to have to come together as one. As one police department, and as one community. Reporting from Algona, Connor O'Neill, Local 5 News. Neither the Cram family nor Algona PD have announced any funeral arrangement, but tomorrow morning, Officer Cram's remains are being escorted from Ankeny up to Algona. Local 5 will continue to provide you with updates on this story.